To solve this question, the first step is that we are going to decompose it. By what do you mean by decomposing? You have to reduce this function to its simplest form so that we will be able to differentiate it easily. You understand? Probably you have not watched my video on how to decompose a complex natural logarithmic function. You can proceed back to the channel and watch the video. There, I explain in details how to differentiate and um, how to decompose a complex natural logarithmic function. Okay, now let us proceed and solve this question. Don't forget that if we have a function like this, we can express this as this. It can be expressed as natural log of a, sorry, plus the natural log of b, plus the natural log of what? C. You understand? Okay, now we are going to use the same step. Y is equal to the natural log of tan cube x plus the natural log of sine square x plus the natural log of cos square x. You understand? Okay, now, don't forget that if we have sine square x is also the same thing as what? Sine x raised to the power of 2. Please, I want you to pay attention. If you have a function like this, sine square x is also the same thing as what? Sine x raised to the power of 2. So if I have um, cos cube x is also the same thing as what? Cos x raised to the power of 3. You understand? If I have tan cube x, cube x is also the same thing as what? Tan x raised to the power of what? 3. You understand? Okay, now let us use the same step. Tan cube x, let us focus on this first. This, oh, sorry, y. Y is equal to natural log of tan x. This theory will come to this place. You understand? Plus the natural log of sine x. And these two will come to this place. Plus the natural log of cos x. And these two also will come to this place. You understand? So now, don't forget from um, the rules for log reading. If I have the natural log of a raised to the power of b, I can write this as b natural log of a. You understand? So let us use the same process in this place. y is equal to what? 3 ln tan x. You understand? Tan x. Tan x plus 2 ln sine x plus uh, 2 ln cos x. You understand? That, this is what I'm doing. I just move this to this point. As I did this, you understand? That's what I just saw. That's what I have done there. You understand? So let's proceed. Y is equal to. Now, let us take the derivative of this function right now. Don't forget that if I have y is equal to the natural log of u, the derivative of y is equal to. First, I'll first take the inverse of the function inside this bracket. Okay? I'll first take the function, I'll, I'll take the inverse. What I mean by inverse is the reciprocal. I will take the reciprocal of this function inside the bracket. So I'm going to have 1 over u multiplied by the derivative of the function inside the bracket. That is how to find the derivative of this. Please, always remember this formula when you are dealing with logarithmic differentiation because it has a long way to go. Let us use the same approach here. Let me put this to it. Now, to differentiate name tan x, the first step is that I'm going to take the inverse of tan x. So I'm going to have 1 over tan x multiplied by. Now, if you differentiate tan x, we're going to get what? Sec square x. You understand? If you differentiate tan x, the tan x is what? Sec square x. You understand? So now, I'll take the inverse of the function inside the bracket, which is tan x. Multiply by the derivative of tan x. The derivative of tan x is what? Sec square x. So I'm going to have sec square x plus 2 into brackets. I'm still going to take the inverse of the function inside the bracket, which is tan x. The inverse of sine o. Oh, the inverse of sine x is what? 1 all over sine x multiplied by derivative of sine x. If you differentiate sine x, you are going to get what? cos x. So this is cos x. Plus 2 into brackets. Now, I'm still going to take the inverse of the function inside the bracket, which is what? Cos x. So I'm going to have 1 over cos x 
1 over cos x multiplied by, oh, let me erase something here. Okay, 1 over cos x multiplied by, if you differentiate cos x, you are going to get what? Minus sine x. So this is what? Minus sine x. Okay, now let us proceed. So the derivative of y, derivative of y is equal to sec square x all over tan, tan x plus 2 into bracket cos x all over sine x plus 2 into bracket minus sine x all over cos x you understand? okay now from our trigonometry from our basic trigonometry don't forget that tan x can be expressed as if you have tan x, tan x can be expressed as, can be expressed as sin x all over cos x. You understand? We can express tan x as sin x over cos x. And if I take the inverse of sin x over cos x is what? Cos x over sin x. And cot x, cot x is what? 1 over what? Tan x. Okay, let us proceed. So the derivative of y is equal to theory sec square x all over tan x plus 2 into bracket cos x over sin x is the inverse of tan x you understand don't forget that tan x is what sin x over cos x so if i take the inverse of sin x over cos x i'm going to get cos x over sin x so cos x over sin x is the inverse of what tan x that is 1 over tan x and don't forget that from our basic trigonometric function Cot x is what? 1 over tan x. So instead of writing 1 over tan x, I'm going to write what? Cot x. You understand? So I'm going to have cot x plus 2 into bracket minus sin x over um, minus sin x over cos x. Don't forget that tan x can be expressed as sin x over cos x. So I'm going to have minus tan x in this place. So I'm going to have this tan x. So the derivative of y, let me put it here, the derivative of y is equal to theory sec square x, theory sec square x, all over tan x, plus 2 cot x, plus 2 cot x, minus 2, minus 2 tan x. You understand? So the derivative of, this is the derivative. The derivative of y is equal to the natural log of tan, um, tan cube x sine square x or square x is what? Um, there is sine square x over tan x plus theory, uh, 2 cot x minus 2 tan x. Please, I want you to subscribe to this channel if you have not done so. And also, please, I want you to follow my page. Follow, follow my page. Follow this page. On this page, I tweeted courses from the scratch you understand and on this channel also i tweeted courses from the scratch you can follow my page on my page on facebook the log academy just search you are going to see just click on the follow button and inbox me when you are followed to receive your gifts thank you very much